why can't you divide by zero? Let's look at it um, in terms of speed, distance, and time. Suppose you're traveling from Ochirius to Kingston, right? And because of traffic and all sort of incidents happening on the road, you mm, take about three hours. Say you have a lot of traffic in Kingston and you're going, for example, to Papin, right? Now, you're in Och Ochirius to Kingston. Is a distance of about 83 and further distance is going to from Kingston is going to say 90 kilometers all right so you have 90 kilometers and you are say in Ochirius at 12 noon you arrive in Kingston at 3 p.m. at 3 o'clock so you're taking three you took you took three hours you took three hours to travel no speed is equal to distance divided by time speed is distance over time the question is what is your average speed at, at this time what's your average speed if at 12 o'clock you're in Ocherius then in 3 o'clock you're in Kingston then the distance is 90 kilometers and your time is three hours so your average speed is 90 divided by 3 30 kilometers per hour all right so you travel at 30 kilometers per hour now let's say you have another situation where you say you're going to Kingston and I see you in Ochirius at 12 o'clock I come back I leave come back at 3 and you're still sitting there at the same spot in Ochirius at 3 o'clock it means that your distance now in the next situation the distance you travel is zero kilometers because you did not move all right you're sitting at the same spot in Ochirius at exactly three o'clock from nine o'clock so your distance is zero kilometers and the time is still three hours so your speed now is zero divided by three it's zero kilometers per hour because you did not cover any distance that's the second situation so that is your new speed let's look at a third scenario suppose I imagine that you are in Ochirius at 12 o'clock right let me get my spelling proper so you're in Ochirius at 12 o'clock and you're going to travel to Kingston you travel to Kingston
and it so happened that you travel so fast you find yourself in Kingston at exactly 12 o'clock no what's your speed your speed is a distance 90 kilometers divided by time but this is suggesting that you travel to Kingston in zero hours in zero time so you're trying to divide by zero no how would that really work out in reality is it possible to travel 90 kilometers in zero time no it's not can't be you can't be in Kingston at exactly 12 o'clock on January 30 2017 say and you travel to Kingston and reach at 12 o'clock on the same day January 30 2017 no that can't be that is impossible so therefore your trying to divide by zero cannot work all right so this is one of the reason why you cannot divide by zero if you could divide by zero it would mean that you could travel 90 kilometer in zero time and that is impossible you cannot travel any distance in zero time and therefore this is one reason why trying to divide by zero doesn't make sense so that is the case for today thank you very much later